Hello everybody and welcome back. For those of you that are new, my name is Anna and this is part two of our master bedroom makeover. We are going to jump right in with cleaning. We're going to get this headboard and footboard um, deep cleaned with my little Bissell Pro Heat machine. I love this little machine. I used to have the little green machine and um, this Pro Heat is a little bit more compact and easy to store and it does an excellent job. I've never shampooed my headboard and my footboard. I've always just vacuumed it, but that didn't seem to be doing the trick anymore. So I decided to go ahead and give it a good shampoo. And I am so happy that I did. When I saw the water, I realized that it is something that I am going to need to do probably twice a year, if not more, um, just to keep it fresh and clean. And it felt so good to get all of that dirt out of there. And you guys will see that <laughs> coming up here in a minute. But anyways, I did want to get this done before um, I made the bed up. I already have the curtains hanging. You saw that in the first video that I cut and hemmed myself. I didn't really hem them. I just ironed on some seam tape and it was easy peasy and they look beautiful. I also changed out the lampshades, which you can see a little bit of one right there. You'll be getting a closer look of all of these things. Um, and in this video, you're going to see the artwork that I ordered. Um, put, you know, I, I put it in the frames and everything and I went ahead and hung those up. And after I was done filming that I realized that they were just too bland on the wall. They needed to pop a little bit. And so um, I did do a, <clears throat> um, a little bit of fixing up to the frames to make them pop off the wall. I painted them with some acrylic paint and they look excellent. And you will see that in the final reveal as well um, at the end of this video. So pay no attention to them <laughs> on the um, on the wall when you see them here because that is not what they look like. Um, but anyways, those are the things that I did. And today we are going to be putting up some of the DIYs that I did uh, in the first video. And everything is looking so good. I do want to say to you that this is not the completed look. We are going to get the two chairs for the foot of the bed. Um, you are going to see me place a new ottoman here. That came from the apartment. It went with my Pottery Barn sofa, and I loved it. But my husband's job is about to end um, in the next several months here. And so as he's coming driving home, when he doesn't fly home, um, he is going to be loading up the truck and bringing stuff with him. So he did bring me a couple of things to use today. Um, so I'm super excited about that. And um, you're going to be seeing me place that. But look at that water that came out of my headboard and my footboard. Ew. So <laughs> anyways, um, so let's get into this video and I will pop in and out as I um, think I need to, if I feel like I need to explain anything. But we need to get this room pulled together so that we can show you guys the final look for now. When you stepped into my life, such a magic feeling, we tore down my walls. I could go back to right before you told me I'd try to change it all But look at us now, I could have gone so far It hurts to realize we're parted Yeah, look at us now, this is who we are And I just know things will never be the same We're like strangers again, again, again Strangers again, again, again Like strangers again, again, again I just know things will never be the same Like strangers again Like strangers again I thought we'd never fall Could have tried much harder So high, higher up than heaven We said we'd reach the stars But look at us now, could have gone so far It hurts to realize we're parted And look at us now, this 
is who we are And I just know things will never be the same Like strangers again, again, again Strangers again, again, again Like strangers again, again, again I just know things will never be the same Like strangers again Started. It's time to get my head up again You said that you had to I'll try to forget you Just didn't think we'd end up this way Like strangers again before I show you the final reveal of the room. I'm going to try and get some shots that really give the feeling of the room. And I'm so pleased with it, you guys. I really was able to pull in the colors and textures so far that I want in the room. Of course, I still need artwork and I haven't found anything that really speaks to me yet. And so I don't want to waste my money just for a video, just so that I can have something to hang on the wall. I really wanted to make sure that I made smart purchases. I'm still excited about the chairs. It's really important to have a couple of chairs in here for us. 
so that we can have a place to retreat to. I can have a place to retreat to that's just ours. Um, so I'm super excited about that. And I definitely will be showing you guys um, all of the things that are coming. This wall back here behind where the table and pottery is, is the wall that we're going to have the bookshelves on. So I'm super excited about that. And I think we have already landed on the ones that we want to buy. Um, you know, and again, that's a future video coming up soon. This room is nowhere near done. There's lots of touches that need to take place in this room. But I think I did a great job getting some stationary pieces and giving myself a base to work off of so that when I'm out shopping, I now know what my room looks like now rather than a blank slate before I couldn't really... Um, figure out what it is that I wanted because I didn't have the space kind of set up yet. And now I do. This is what the room looked like before, not complaining. I think that the room was beautiful in its own right, but it wasn't me. It was just there. Um, and it just was there. I don't know. There was no filling. There was no warmth in it. And um, that was really important to me. So now we're going to take a look at the final reveal um, of today, um, what it looks like today. And um, I hope you guys enjoy. so much for watching today. I hope that this video gave you some inspiration to tackle a room or a space in your home that you've been wanting to redo. And um, I'm in love with it. I just got to say, I'm just so happy with it. And I can't wait to to continue and to do more in this room. Um, hey, if you haven't clicked subscribe, I hope you plan on doing that before you leave because like I said, we've got lots coming up and not just for this room, for the house in total. So you don't wanna miss that. Make sure to click the bell notifications to be notified when I upload a video. I upload two videos a week. I do cleaning, cooking, um, gardening, um, organizing, shopping, the whole thing. And um, if that's something that you enjoy, um, I hope that you plan on sticking around. So I hope you guys have a wonderful day, a wonderful weekend, a wonderful weekday, whatever it is, whenever it is that you're watching this video, and we will see you in the next one. Bye.